Nathan with Canoe Kentucky here with a quick lesson on water levels. Why is it important to understand the level on your, your local waterway? Well, here specifically on the Elkhorn Creek, we can have low water conditions, but more importantly, we can have too high of water conditions. And sometimes that's difficult to understand. It would be hard pressed for you to understand what I mean when I say today's level is 4.05 feet. What does that mean for your experience? The best way to plan your experience is jump on our website, canoeky.com, and head over to the Water Conditions tab. Once there, you're going to see a live view camera that's actually located right here on our back porch. You can see for yourself what the water looks like, but even more importantly, scroll down the page and see some graphs that are going to represent the levels of the day. Uh, water levels are typically understood in three different ways. We want to make sure we know the level, we want to make sure we know the flow, and we want to make sure we know the temperature. The level, how high is it? Could it be three foot, six foot, ten foot, or whatever? So it's important to understand those. We make it very simple with some color-coded charts. We have an orange level, green level, blue level, yellow level, and red level. And just think of them like traffic lights when it comes to green, yellow, and red. Green meaning all go ahead, yellow meaning caution, and red meaning stay away. The blue and the orange, a little bit more caution on the blue, and definitely low water conditions on the orange. All that's completely explained on our website. The flow is how fast the water is moving. If you think about one basketball passing by us here every given second, we call that one CFS or one cubic feet per second. Understanding flow helps you to understand that today's level is around 1300 CFS, meaning that could be 1300 basketballs floating past us every single second. Much, much faster and you need to use some caution when it comes to that. Flow is very important if you're getting into some more moving water paddling. And it's also important to understand the temperature. Realize at any time the air temperature and the water temperature combined equal 110 degrees or less. You need to be prepared for a hypothermic situation. So if the water temperature today is 52 degrees, the air is only 50, those added together equal 102, you would want to be dressed accordingly if you were to end up in the water today. Very important to understand your water conditions. Easiest way again to do that, jump on our website at canoeky.com and go to water conditions. And don't ever hesitate to give us a phone call at 888-CANOE-KY and talk to one of our experts and we can help you have the safest possible experience on the creek.